I know you think you want to be free, Deadshot. I'd give you real freedom. From choice. Morality. Guilt. You once killed a target from a mile away, Lawton. What if I had the enhancements to let you kill from a continent away? Yes, come for me again. But consider that all theories of warfare posit that you hold back your strongest assets for the end game. You want to be a leader so badly, don't you? You want a title worthy of respect. I could give that to you, Lawton. The way forward is with me. Try to be less predictable, Deadshot. Consider how very boring this must be for me. There's so much in store, Task Force X. Fight as you will, your reward for staying alive will be to witness evolution. Deadshot. Isn't that redundant, Floyd? After you join me, you can choose a new name. In fact, I'd encourage it. Floyd Lawton, we both know that the worst torture I can inflict on you is to trap you in your own mind. And I could. You've done well, marshalling the other three, Lawton. New Kolu could use that kind of leadership, that strength of vision. Lawton, I do wish you'd carefully consider my offer. As anomalies go, you are impressive. I do not approach every Earthling who can hold a gun. You like calculating the odds, Lawton. Let me ask you, is this the best way to protect your kin? Trying the patience of a world-conquering genius. Lend me your power. In turn, I'll relieve you of all your mortal burdens. It's a good deal, Lawton. As much of a compromise as I will offer. I select only the best and most unique for my collection. Tell me, Harley, doesn't it make sense that I should approach you first? Hmm? Being last on the shelf makes toys unspeakably sad, doesn't it, Harley Quinn? You've never been anyone's first choice. And yet, my offer is open. Why choose these people over me? I've only ever lauded your abilities, your intellect. I can see the real Harleen. Harley, what about Ivy? I could save her. Use her. Give her a world to make beautiful and green. Once new Kolo is made, I'll allow it. Why not leave this world behind and start anew? I can provide an army fit for a queen such as yourself. To be snuffed out on a backwater world when you could be raised to the stars. Do you think anyone appreciates that cosmic joke, Harley Quinn? Need I remind you, Harley, they put you in a box and abandoned you. As one of my favorite lieutenants, no one would ever forget you. Even if you join me, I'm afraid I can't be the parental figure you so obviously crave, Harley. Kaluan parental relationships are more complicated than disappointing mummy and daddy. Trust me, at my side, he wouldn't play second fiddle to anyone. Not a sharpshooter, not a has-been, and definitely not a shark. I'm giving you the chance to be the star you are. Take control of your own story. Isn't that what you've always wanted, Harley? You've always stood out from the rest, Harley. I've studied many anomalies, but none as enigmatic as you. What is it you want, Harley? Is it validation you seek? I'll validate you on a universal scale. There's a version of you, Harley, that would enjoy being on the other side of this. Perhaps you lost her along with your edge. Too bad. You think you'll have a life after all this, Harley? After me? They'll lock you away. I would thaw you from stasis again and again. I can think of so many ways to take you apart, Harley Quinn. But don't worry. I promise to remake you better than your wildest dreams. Anomaly or no, Harley, resist me to the end, and you'll die forgotten. This whole world will be forgotten, but you, in particular, I will omit. I'm offering you a greater reality than this, Harkness. All your wildest desires, even more than unlimited tinnies. 
I don't blame you for your deficiencies, Heartless. It's your unwillingness to grow that disappoints. You've come a long way from a filthy backwater at the edge of this world. I could help you go so much further, Boomerang. You have a knack for underachieving, Boomerang, honed over a lifetime. Let me wring a more spirited performance out of you. You know as well as I do, Digger Harkness, that it's a fluke you've come this far. Failing upward. Last chance to join the winning team. You've tested your metal. I've adjusted my stratagem. It sounds like we'll both be more prepared for our next tete-a-tete. -tete. Don't assume you're special, Harkness. You are an anomaly, a fluke, a deviant deviation. I will give you the enhancements necessary to reach your full potential, Harkness. Consider that. All the boomerangs at your disposal. I can release you from misery, Harkness. Never again would you feel doubt or self-loathing. Doesn't that sound nice? You will break first, Task Force X. I need this. You are just feeding a momentary set of mutable desires. They will pass, along with you and your irrelevant species. This unexpected synergy has forced some corrections. But be assured, you will be corrected. You're of kings, Nanawe. Wasting your time on this earth with these people? Or above all this? Yours is a refined destiny. Now that I know the talents at your disposal, I can plan for you. You become part of the equation. Simple. While there's only giving you more leash, Nanawe, I want to cut you loose. Let you use your teeth allow you to kill. You're wasting your potential on this earth, Nanawe. Don't you see? We have a future as kings of a new world. Let's not prolong the inevitable. Failure is all part of the evolutionary paradigm. However, in my case, failure is no longer the end of the cycle. You know how many physical copies I have. Why go on? Aren't you tired? Mistreated. This type of long game is too much for you, overworked few. Without me, you'll be remembered for what you are, Nanawe. Deposed ruler of a shallow little puddle. How tragic. A mistake of my last consciousness, considering all of you uninformed. Believe me when I say it won't happen again. This isn't the time for posturing, Nanawe. Let's be serious with one another. You were made for greater things. You are always the smallest of your herd, Nanawe. The runt. It still weighs on you, doesn't it? You deflect your weaknesses with sarcasm and violence, Task Force X. But I see you. I know you better than you know yourselves. You fell so easily for Wallace Bait, Nanawe, and here you are, wriggling on a jagged hook. I can free you from this so-called life. You know how many physical copies I have. Why go on? Aren't you tired? Mistreated? This type of long game is too much for you, overworked few. Tell me, after your kingdom was taken from you, was this the company you intended to keep? Taking orders from those who don't understand you? Come now, Nanawe. Your people enjoy perks, yes? No fear? No pain, a true socialist society. Most of all, a direct connection to me. I know you are attached to this earth, Nanawe, but it was a first draft, a sketch of what could be. Don't you want to be in the finished picture? Nanawe, just a reminder that you're putting your life on the line for humans. Duplicitous, vivisecting humans.